Good afternoon and welcome to my new YouTube page where we expose the corruption, the false allegations and the abuse going on in the places that are meant to be safeguarding the public and our children. Now today, a disgusting story has been posted regarding a mental health site in Salford, Greater Manchester. It's namely the Edenfield Mental Health Unit in the grounds of the former Presswich Hospital. There was a panorama documentary, I believe, aired last night. Um, I'm just going to go on and read this story now in the evening news. Police have launched an investigation into an alleged mistreatment of patients at a mental health unit. The Manchester Evening News understands that the allegations involve 40 patients, 25 staff, and that more than a dozen staff have been suspended. The Edenfield Centre, based in the grounds of the former Presswich Hospital in Berra, is the focus of the inquiry. The unit cares for adult patients. The Manchester Evening News understands that action was taken after the BBC Panorama programme embedded a reporter undercover in the unit and then presented evidence to the NHS Trust, which runs the mental health unit. It then goes on to say that Edenfield Centre has 11 wards. It is understood staff working on both male and female wards have been suspended and the centre has been closed to new admissions. In a statement, a spokesperson for GMP said, Greater Manchester Police has opened an investigation into a number of allegations against staff at the Edenfield Centre following a period of undercover, undercover filming sorry, at the mental health unit. Head of Greater Manchester Police's Public Protection Department, Chief Superintendent, Attendant Michaela Kerr said, It goes without saying that these allegations are concerning. Since they were brought to our attention, we've been working with partner agencies to ensure the safeguarding of vulnerable adults. We've also obtained the information required to obtain open criminal investigations and inquiries are ongoing to ensure all offences are recorded and those involved identified. In a consultation with the CPS, we are reviewing footage from Panorama with a view to prosecuting anyone who's captured committing a crime. Anyone who has concerns about care their loved one has received should contact them on Crime Stoppers. Now, I went on to read this story and it was heartbreaking being the parent of two autistic children. Now, there was a there was a lady in there, a girl in there. I'm not going to mention her. She's autistic. She was admitted for self-harming. Now, on the Panorama documentary, I believe, she was filmed screaming in the corridor on the floor. It then appeared eight members of staff dragged her back to a seclusion unit where she'd already just spent the last two weeks. That's just one case, one allegation of a number of possible abuses that have gone on at this place. Um, it's heartbreaking. It's really heartbreaking. And I hope the people responsible that had a duty of care to safeguard these people abuse their positions of trust, abuse those patients, hurt those patients. Justice will come to you. And everybody involved. It's disgusting. Please like, follow, share, subscribe to my page. Yeah, I'm a bit rough around the edges, still learning the ropes. But my job is to report on the corruption, the abuse, the false allegations, and everything else that helps ruin families, innocent families. Edger. Out.